So here I have a very basic scene with the player scene and a tile map node added in the main scene. And in the player scene, I have added a sprite 2D and a collision shape 2D with a script attached to the root node. Inside the script, there is nothing right now. So let's create the movement. First, declare two variables for the speed and jump force of the player. You can give these any values you want. Then declare another variable for the gravity with the default value being 980. Then in the physics process function, check if the player is currently not touching the ground using the is on floor method. And if that's true, we are going to add the y velocity of player to the gravity value multiplied by delta. Then we are going to check if we press the jump key. And to make sure that the player cannot jump forever, we are also going to check if the player is on the floor while pressing the jump key. And if the both conditions are true, we are going to set the velocity.y equal to the negative jump force. We are setting negative because up direction in Godot is negative. Then for the left and right movement, declare a variable for the direction and set its value to input.getAxis with the negative and positive actions added in the parentheses as strings. You have to add these actions in the product settings. Then we are going to set the velocity equal to a vector2 and inside the parentheses of the vector2 for the x value we are going to give direction multiplied by speed and for the y value just write velocity.y and finally call the move and slide method to actually make the player move and that's all you have to do to create a basic 2d platformer controller